Hi, I'm Debbie DeWitt with Visix. And more than likely, you have a group of people who work really hard to maintain your corporate identity and your brand standards. So you need to think about those brand standards when you're creating your digital signage content. Usually, your brand consists of your logo, logo type, font styles, and colors that you use to consistently reinforce your brand to the public. Sometimes you may even have published brand standards that you can reference. When designing digital signage content, you need to ask yourself the following questions. Do you need to include the logo? If so, make sure you have a high resolution copy of the logo to work with. And if your logo has a color background, try and eliminate that and use either a white or black copy, or design your background to match the logo background color. Second question, do you have standard colors to work with? Most companies have defined their PMS print colors or print formulas, so start with those and find their equivalent RGB colors for digital designs. Remember, colors look very different in print than they do on the screen. If you don't have standardized colors, just pick six to eight that complement your logo and that way you'll have more to work with. In addition to brand standardized colors, you can also use color systems within your overall themes. For example, if your logo is blue and green, you could standardize to have blue backgrounds for general information, green for important announcements, and red for security and alerts. Color cues will help your audience to easily recognize the messages they're interested in, and over time, you can train viewers to look for colors related to specific types of information. This is especially important when it comes to alerts. Lastly, which fonts should you use? You can still use fun fonts to make your communications exciting, but remember to incorporate your approved textiles wherever you can. And remember, don't use too many fonts in a design. A good rule is no more than two fonts on a single bulletin. Some organizations have an image library that you can choose from, and your intranet or internet sites can be really good resources for graphics that have already been through the approval process. If you're not sure about your brand standards, your PR or marketing department is probably a very good place to start. Thanks for watching, and check out our other videos for more digital signage tips and advice on our YouTube channel, or visit us at physics.com.